Hello everybody, and today we are playing Hearts of Iron 4. This beautiful piece of machinery. Now, ignore the Poland thing, we're not playing Poland. Uh, everyone normally plays Germany, I play a bit of France sometimes on Road to 56 or P in some Italy. Now, they're all pretty, I mean, Italy sucks, but they're all pretty okay countries, you know? Now, we plan today. Obviously, Germany. Germany. Iron Man mode. Regular difficulty. Actually, well, I don't have cheats, but they are some add-ons, so I guess I could just keep Iron Man mode to, to yeah. All right, Iron Man mode difficulty start. Ignore these. These are nothing. Let's go. Go away. Go oh my god, this is annoying. Please go away. Go away. Anyway, so, <clears throat> the, uh, um, how do I put this? Okay, here we are. Germany. The German... <sighs> right, I don't think I have to do that, do I? And, uh, Mr. Himmler. Yes, the beautiful man. Um, okay. Historical, four-year plan. All the divisions in. Get all the Panzers. Do a separate group. Along with the truck. Get all the Mountaineers together. This is just one, so I guess you just leave them. But. Look at that. Anyway, so we have a 24 with, or no, 24. 24 division of infantry. We can do Division. And don't delete that. These, these guys will stay in the corner, just mind their own business. Anyway, so right now we are in a tight situation. Because, you know, we have countries all around us. And Mr. Himmler wants to expand. That is the plan. But, you know, Germany can't just do that in 2.0 seconds. We have to build up for it. Uh, close air support, perfect. So. Took all of that in there. Alright, so now we need to go over here. The Dutch East, we're gonna want that from you. Thank you. Uh, I think we're ready. Go. The game's just gonna fly by because that's what we do. And then we just wait for this to finish. But in the meantime, we have technology that we can put to. That's happening. Back here. Couple cities, some rivers. This game's beautiful, bro. Look at this thing. Now yeah, I'm pretty sure I have historical one. Anyway, since I need to milk. The utmost factories out of there. Yeah, normally I love grinding the four year plan before I do Rhineland, but I only rush until I get this and then we're done. I don't think I need France, do I? I think I only need all switches to be in my Oh, never mind, because I'm doing all. 
Normally I soar in uh, the reflex use for like, the uh, things change. Okay. Ready. Now, we have a good amount of men, good amount of guns, and start training some infantry. Never mind, we don't have any good amount of guns. We have deficits, no 2k guns, not bad actually. Oh, pause because I messed up. Oopsies. Anyway, so, the plan for Germany invade the Netherlands, Austria, Poland, that, you know what I mean. You know, the good old what Mr. Himmler actually did. But, but. Can my videos get demonetized? Mr. Mustache Man will, um, conquer the chunk of Europe. No, oh, that gives me military construction speed. Perfect. Oh, now we go over to Brian Land and we finish it. Right now these are poopy uh, 18 minutes, but they're they're actually not bad because of these, but right now they suck. Just ignore that. Will I have any downside on my guns because I did that? No, but Factions, common turn, allies, axis. Civil War, perfect. You take these three bad boy tanks. You go to you go to the National Spain. You're like, hey yo, National Spain. You go send volunteers and look two, perfect. Also, you get good old two panel divisions in there. <clears throat> Just cause. Send volunteers. Make sure you're able to send air volunteers. Click that guy. Send them. You just hit unpause and bada bing bada boom. Now you're involved in the Spanish Civil War. Now, ignore it. You take these beautiful planes, like the ones with close, no, wrong, wrong thing. Like the ones with close air support, like none of you. Okay, well we'll go over here. We'll spawn in some close air support, which is cast, is what I like to call it. Okay, so they're just fighting the thing. Probably 
None of you. You're a cast. Yes, you go. You're naval bombers. And you're fighters. Okay. You go over there too. Just because these guys are going to be important for the Civil War. Interwar fighters are the same. It's really matter. They're basically the same thing, just weirder. Uh, no, I'm not going to merge all the air wings. Take these guys. Send them in Spain. Just get them in there. Fight in the Civil War. All your volunteers are in the middle of being made. Get some cast going. Government since they arrived. Good, good, good. Get the actual fighters and place them over there and tell them to fight for air superiority. Boom! See? Now we're doing good for air superiority. And we have these guys, which can be used to just clean up the damage. I'm just gonna run them up. And on the contrary, let me get a... And look at that! Take me by the pocket. Easy piece Or you can just easily cut through them. And they de -org. And as soon as you push them, you just continue to push them and they just be de-organized. So, pretty easy, just de -org them. Anyway. So. Cast damage probably pretty good over here. I want to know how good are we on cast. 6.6. .6. No, 11. Wow. Okay, I like that. That's a lot of cast damage. Ooh, if we can take this, that'd be a nice... Oh, no, they aren't, so let's go. Good job, boys. See, that's the beauty of having a tank. Is that, you know, they get encircled. You encircle the enemy pretty, pretty easily. Uh, you know, I want to get the rest of my... Oh, perfect, more fighters. I could use them, actually. Uh, da 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 Oh, normal fighters. That's even better. I'm gonna train them all. Uh, you ignore everything else for now and continue down this path. Now it's 1936, and we get more prone. Uh, fighters, those are bombers. Why have my fighters moved? finish these two perfect so we are actually gonna be bombed a bunch because of the British so the space industry and that means to get a good head start. Rocking their world during the Civil War. And that's almost done, which will be helpful for more troops, because we need more- Look, well, look. Okay, so, see, we have 317 army in the field. We need 5,000 to do Angelus. That way we can do the rest of the thing about- And this is the alternate history, which I can never do. At least not- I rarely do it. Kill that pocket, and then I'll have to go kill the other one soon. I'm not there to kill it. Good, good, good. This one's about to die as well, which means I can start in the war for Madrid. Okay, now let me just do this because it's way easier. This one's still heading in that direction, which is nice. My phone just decided to do a beep beep. Okay, random, but alright. Anyway. Alright, so are they there? Yes, they are. Perfect. These two. Okay, 
it's not success. Oh no, it's kind of successful. Uh, first question of business: unplanned offensive? No, it's raining over here. Fine. All right. Well, now that that's over, with fighters. I want you to focus on this front instead. Thank you. While the gas is completely destroying this side. Because look, 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 six. A lot of damage is being done due to cast, which is a good thing for us. Because more cast damage, the better. Do. do I have any cans? Or yeah, we have more cans. Let's go. We got more cans. Can I bring it over? I don't think I can. So. This is just to grind XP. So it's good thing uh, Jump over here. You'd be like, oh yeah, it's perfect. I do this one. Then yeah. Let's get an infantry leader. If we don't have that much mountaineers and stuff anymore. If you don't I don't we don't keep we're not meant to have to have that we have to cross. Right, now that we have a bunch of PP saved up, I don't know what you do with that PP. You start upgrading stuff, my friend. Like you get a captain of industry. And a... Well, we don't need a war industrialist due to MIFO bills. Because of this, it also helps out with Civ. So, pretty good. Um, we can get more political power. Through one of these guys. One of these guys have a ooh war sport. I'll take that. Oh, we don't really need that. Okay, so we're pretty good on that. Army drill expert. He's pretty good if you're going to switch to a thingamabob to extensive without having the training debuff. Uh, that's about it, which I'm probably gonna do soon. Because these are level twos, exercise them. Continue with the war. Successful war. All right, what do we got going on here? Um, just taking that drag bullet disc already away. Because I mean, they're they're not like the Alright, now that we've researched the first... What was the first? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. First level 2 is gonna take some time. Uh, I normally just brush my wounds. Anyway, air speed is really important. It really helps out. Oh, look. But it's good for us, you wanna lie? I love to see it. Anyway, while that's going on. Ah, yes, airdroptions. Airdroptions. See, that's why you participate in the Spanish Civil War. Airdroptions. You get more air than normal armor. Pockets being cleaned up. I'm going to get my cast out and bring it to the south. Keep 
fight this day. So there's three pockets of extra ideas. And that is exactly why Germany is around. Yeah. And the Spanish Civil War is about to wrap up, which is very nice. Another 100 PP. Put into that. What is it? Oh, yeah. That. Oh, perfect. They finished their uh, civilian ideals, which means. More mills because they need mills. But we got the troops back, boys. What happened to my tank commander? Where are my tanks? Let's get more tanks. They're actually pretty good. Division doing their level threes, which means stop exercising because then we're just losing guns for no reason. That, that's just useless, but it gets radio tower, which is kind of important. Uh, logistics company is important to save supply consumption. Uh, Rex back, not really that important. This is important, give sieves. Uh, let's get more closer support. And fighters, and close air support, and bombers. Just a tad bit more bombers. Close air support is really important. Now. And let's get more of you from the Soviets. You know we, you know we're gonna go to war with the Soviets based off of normal everyday journey. Luckily though, these should be built pretty fast thanks to the NIFA rules. And we are training enough tanks to not have enough food. Good to know. Oh, I 
Who's trained 16 of the guns today? Must have saved a lot of guns. Yeah, so I have a lot of guns ready to go. Man, 21, 20, 22, 23, 24. Then will they start yelling at me? Oh, yeah, they're yelling at me. A cute imbecile. Nah, yeah, they should be fine. Support equipment, probably not, but everything else will be fine. We have enough trucks to support this, right? I don't know if we have the ground power to support it. That's fine. Doesn't matter if we don't. Stuff to construction. Uh, this Greek theorist, wherever he is. 200, dang, okay. Sure all these dudes are on one time because you don't want to do that like 20 times and just kill your manpower. That would suck. But look at that. Now we get. Now we have 559 in the army. Which is very nice. That was fast. Need more fighters. We'll put them into fighters. Speaking of fighters, you should probably train some of these planes seeing that they're new. There's the air wings. Uh, close air support. There's, actually, do I have any more close air support? I have a lot of fighters everywhere. Smart enough. Yeah, here's some fighters and close or er, close air support. He's Mabel. I think be Mabel. They don't have the Naval sign. Oh, yeah, they're just clearly. That's just them. Now, all these fighters merge. And we have one massive fighter group. We just train. And then one massive dive bomber group, which we just train. Maybe we split them up later, but for right now we have a good amount of fighters and a good amount of big boom boys. And the obvious is but that is to be expected. More ships. Alrighty. See, the, nothing crazy has been. You just saw me fighting in Spain. Uh, the idea of going after Austria is going to happen soon, but I'm just making sure that I have the ability to build more mills first. Let's just build two. And let's build two. Just because the more the merrier. All the north, that's where I put them all. I don't know if there's like a particular way you should put them, but I just put them in the north. Anyway, medium tank chassis. Medium tanks. Basic heavy cannon. Eh. Medium turret. Fixed. Two man. I mean, it does up a lot of things. Three man just up a, up a bit of things. But two man is the best. Radio, level 1, special modules, sloped armor, heavy gun. Yeah, see, okay. Control small things. And none of these affect the breakthrough of the site. No, no, right? 
Oh, this affects breakthrough. Is the reliability really bad? Well, let's get Christine instead, because it does mess with the breakthrough, but it's not as bad. Diesel actually gives me a lot of stability. But this just gives me max speed. It's not needed, so diesel will be a good thing. Disgusting. Pause. Pause real quick. Jesus Christ. Anyway. Then we can get this without hurting the stability too much. Perfect. The reliability, I should say, since it's not really stability. Uh, additional guns does do a lot of things. But ammunitions... Oh, it gives it reliability. There's no need to go above that. So let's just get additional guns. No, three probably. <laughs> Okay, so we have a basic Panzer medium tank. I don't like that whatsoever. I like that. I'll take that. That's better. We have a basic Panzer medium. We have a basic Panzer medium tank. Right here. Which is not bad. I have to keep the light tanks involved, though. I'm going to have to see what these light tank divisions look like. Okay, so it's like two two and two motorized. Okay, I see. So if I do a division design now, except I go Panzer division and I mess with it a bit, is not like duplicated, but updated with more modernized division and template instead. Now we'll give it a skull just cause, and we'll cover them in medium tanks and see how good it becomes obviously I don't have enough stuff to do that okay see look we'll go that 4.9 weight does go up supply use goes up this goes up and production cost obviously goes up fuel capacity goes up but defense 116 130 13 soft attack piercing 34 Armor 32, not bad. But now if we up it a bit more, do we just do this? Look at all those numbers skyrocket. Boom, a lot of numbers just go up. Which is the idea here. That is the plan. But then the average reliability is still 82, which is actually pretty good. Pretty sure we don't need these actually, it's just this. 40 with tanks, tank division. Um, 247 heart attack, 351 this. Everything goes up considerably by a lot. But... Might be worth it. This might be worth it. Organization is 21, which actually sucks. But, you know, it might, it's pretty insane, but it might just work. I only have enough sieves to do this. Let's get an extra research slot. Those are always nice to have. Um, now we have a bunch of divisions ready to go. Like 11. After this, I'm pretty sure I'll be able to. Yep, we can do Angel List afterwards. Oh, there's eight divisions? Um, 
smoothly. I'm gonna train them over here on the right line, it might be easier. You guys can just stand there while you enjoy your supply. How's the mills coming along? Good to see it. Good to see it. I love seeing a bunch of mills, man. I just love seeing them. As my factory count just continues to skyrocket. Look at this factory count. Delicious 45 sieves. 41 mills. Oh my gosh. It's amazing, bro. Total factories is insane. Alright, well, it's 1937, that is, this is actually the campaign, some supplies that we do need, more medium tanks, how are you guys doing, level 3 is good, stop training, good more tanks, I'm going to stick them in there, and merge them up, and then you turn it Man, we have so many close air. Well, these fighters though are actually pretty good, but the close air? Insane amount of it, we just keep producing them. It. It's insane. So I'll make a new division area. So we'll have a... No, I just want one big death stack. I just want one huge death stack that I could just kill everything with. I love just having one big death stack. It's actually kind of funny. Ah, oh, the tanks are going Come to your corporal. Okay. Now, let's hear this. Medium tank design. Very good. More of this. Put it onto the tank. The rest of it can go into gas. There's three sieves. Throw out the window due to production. Well, now that I have an 8, I'm pretty sure I need 10 to do that. Just add a logistics company to them, because it ups a lot of stuff. Their breakthrough goes up, and there's some other stuff down. But then their average an okay amount, their weight goes up, their board goes down. It's not that bad. Could be worse. Now, these divisions are going to be terrible. I'm going to delete them for uh, use. Later in the days to come. Now, where's the. Okay, probably not here then. Here they are. 300 years. 99. Don't worry about those. That's not. That's, you know, it's totally okay. Those aren't going to come in handy. I'm gonna joke about it coming handy real soon. So close, man, so close. I need to stop training. Then this goes flooding upward. After they're done training. Then you wait for that bar to get ready, and then when you're gonna declare war on someone, you just let that fill. Let's go to the giant death stack. I completely forgot about the Navy. Here's up the Navy. Put 
to also one big death stack. Boom. Alright. You. Oh. Okay, well, anyway, eat the cast that I just fed you. And I want you to take all the fighters that I just fed you. I'm still getting more cast, Jesus Christ. Alright, continue training. Continue your training. Yeah, I'm gonna run out of oil real soon. America! I know you hate the Germans, but I could use some oil. That's a lot of saves. I'll take 10 saves. See, look at all that. That's that that fixes our problem dearly. Alright. So while well, that happens, I wanna make sure that we don't, you know, waste all that. Saves that we're giving away. Almost done. Good, good, good. Oh, now that we got 10, we can go to our infantry, tell them, hey, yo. We should have just screwed them all up. Here. No, no, they're all pretty fine, actually. Nope, seems to be good, pretty good for them. Pretty, pretty good. Uh, more cash. We're getting one per day. We're gonna make, like, god tier. God tier sized cast divisions. I want like a 600 units of cast just ready to be deployed whenever we need it. And I want at least 400 fighters to be ready whenever we need it. Okay. Oh, welcome to the right. Now, what are your divisions? You probably suck. Let's see what you got here. Alright. What do we got? What do we have? Okay. So, they're mountaineers. Four by two by two. Comes on. Anyway, two by two. And then this is also two by two. So their division sucks. No, it's the same. Their infantry template is worse than ours. And their other one is basically just ours. So, and I need infantry template four. Okay, we now have more mountaineers. I don't think I have any of the mountaineers. Just gonna shuck them. Spam the mountaineers. Spam the horse. Actually, the horse might be pretty good. Let me check. Yeah. Span it. All the infantry, though, depending on which one they are, I guess they can stay. Let's go train with this guy. Okay. Yeah, you need a leader. We really forgot about that. Uh, you can have him. And how are the? Oh yeah. Wow. Um, gas. Guns. Boom. All right. Now, how much am I producing per day of gas? 1.5. Not bad, actually. And we have 8. Let me just do this real quick. Till the 8 to set sail. Do our little cast, buddy. Alright, so we literally have a stack of 355 casts. And 350 fighters. So I'm gonna let them finish their training until they hit level 3's, then, yeah, leave them for a minute or two. Just let the oil build up. What, what just happened? Did you just level 3 all of a sudden, and then you just went away? There you go. Let you sit down for a second. Yep, yeah, they're done too, so we'll just let you guys chill. For a good old while. Because that is a lot of cast and a lot of other stuff that is actually going to help us dearly. I can stick you here and there, which is actually going to be pretty good. 
And I'm pretty sure the Czechs are guaranteed by people, am I right? Yeah, they're guaranteed by Romania. Oh, then this is the perfect time to strike. Oh, my division's got kind of cocked up, too. Okay, that's fine. Alright, we're gonna attack Romania. Or Czechoslovakia. Which will also end up going to war with Romania, but that's perfect. I don't know why it's perfect, you're about to find out. Anyway, once you hit level 2, so I'll ignore them. Alright, well, I'm gonna save here. This is uh, the beginning. Well, I'll catch you guys in the next one.